because in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to implement both navigation in Android. We are going to add a custom navigation menu and even listen to a click. For instance, when you click dashboard, we are going to post a message indicating your click dashboard. So let's get started. I'm going to start by creating a new project, new, and I'm going to select a bottom navigation activity. Then I'm going to call this one bottom. Now, and then I'm going to finish. So loading the project. So the project is processing, then we have our project ready here. So this is a fresh project. We have fragment dashboard, we have fragment home, and we have fragment notification. At the menu, we have home, we have dashboard and notification. And at the navigation, we have even home, dashboard, and notification. So I'm going to learn this one and see what we have. So let me close this one. So Gradle will learning and storing the application. Launching the application. So by default, we have dashboard and we have notification and home. So I'm going to add a custom one that will be users. The menu. I'm going to have another item. ID. I'm going to give it navigation users. I'm going to give it icon at drawable. Not this one. I'm going to download an icon new vector set. Then I'm going to download a user icon. I'm going to give it a title of users. So we can learn and see what you have. Installing the application. So we have our users, but now it's showing only the icon. We don't have the rebels. So let me configure so that we can be able to see even the rebels. So I'm going to have up label visibility labeled. So if I learn again, let's see. launching the application. So we have our rebels. When I click dashboard, notification. When I click users, there is no effect. So I'm going to add on click listener to the users. So I'm going to go to my layout, create a new layout. And I'm going to call it fragment users. I'm going to copy the text here and paste it in my fragment users. I'm going to change the ID to text users. Then I'm going to go to my mobile navigation and create a new navigation. So I'm going to have flagment. I'm going to give it ID navigation users. And I'm going to give it name. 
for now i'm going to go to dashboard i'm going to give it label users and i'm going to give it tools at layout we have fragment users so i'm going to create a fragment where i can be able to assign my fragment to these navigation users so let me drag this one my main activity I'm going to create a package call it users i'm going to create fragment users fragment i'm going to extend fragment i'm going to create my view model so users view model and i'm going to extend view model i'm going to have private mutable live data string and text i'm going to generate constructor here Within the constructor, I'm going to have my M text is equals to new mutable like data. And I'm going to give it a value of user fragment. Then I'm going to have public like data of type string get text. which I'm going to return my text. Back to my main, that is fragment. I'm going to have a variety of create view. I'm going to have my private user view model, user view model. Then my user view model will be view model providers of these and i'm going to get my class user view model dot class then i'm going to have view view which is equal to inflator dot infrate all dot layout dot fragment user container and i'm going to assign it to first and i'm going to return my view i'm going to find my text view text view users which is view dot find view by id all dot id dot Let's see the ID of the users. It's here, text users. Then I'm going to assign it text. So I'm going to have user view model dot get text dot observe get view lifecycle owner. I'm going to have new observer. And then I'm going to assign this text dot set text as this should be final back to my mobile navigation and i'm going now to change from dashboard to users then to my main activity i'm going to add the id so i'm going to have all.id.navigation users which is here so let's learn our activity and see what we got Installing the application. So we have dashboard, we have notification. And then we have users, user fragment, we have notification, dashboard, and we have home. So I'm going to add on click listener, where when you click dashboard, I'm going to do a message where I'll say you have clicked the dashboard. So on my main activity, I'm going to listen to the navigation controller. So navigation controller dot 
add on destination change listener new on destination change listener i'm going to have int id which is equals to destination dot get id so switch id so case all dot id dot navigation dashboard i'm going to break so i'm going to toast dot make text main activity dot this and the message should be dashboard i'm going to say toast dot length long dot share so let's run and see Storing the application. So when I create dashboard, we have a toast dashboard, notification, and users. So that's all, guys. Thank you for watching. If you have any question or clarification, you can comment below. If you're not subscribed, remember to subscribe for more tutorials.